Today we're gonna to do something different. We're gonna make some fish in the Big Easy Oilless Fryer. In that mild fish, we're bringing in a Wahoo from the Pacific Ocean. We're gonna make a salsa for it. We're gonna marinate it. I hope you stay with me. I've got a one pound filet of Wahoo. What we've got over here, a teaspoon each of uh, lemon juice and lime juice. Got some olive oil, half a teaspoon black cracked pepper, half a teaspoon Himalayan sea salt. We got a teaspoon here, Luton Booty Barbecue Everything Rub, two tablespoons of garlic paste, and a teaspoon of red chili sauce. I hope you can see that anyway. I just want to mix this stuff up and you could certainly use a bowl, but I'm all about not having, having to wash any more dishes than I need to today. So I'm just going to put all these goodies in here. I'll try to be very, very careful. Mix this up. I am going to move it into a Ziploc bag anyway, so it doesn't have to be perfect. Here we got a gallon Ziploc bag. I almost dropped it. That would have been a mess. All right. Now, if you want, you can just smush it around here. It'll help get it mixed up a little bit better. That's better than stirring it, actually. And now we're going to get that beautiful Wahoo filet, one pound. Let's get this bag out of the way. Let me get most of the air out. Doesn't have to be perfect. And then I'm just going to make sure that this marinade is all over this Wahoo filet. And what we want to do is move this into the fridge. And I'll let it marinate somewhere between 30 minutes and one hour. Mahi here has been marinating 45 minutes. Get this guy out. Look at that. Now, in this whole Mahi, I said Mahi, I'm sorry. Wahoo. And this whole Wahoo spirit of things, I'm gonna cook these guys on a piece of pineapple, huh? What do you think about that? I think it'll be kind of cool. And let me get a paper towel, wipe my hands off. I'm gonna come back in with that everything rub. Just a little, not a lot. Don't need a lot. Like so. Yeah, going to move this out of the way. Got my big easy basket here. Do a little Pam to keep things from uh, sticking. Yeah, I'll just put that piece in there like so. We'll get this piece in here like so. Let's get over to this big easy. Got a Wahoo here. I've got this big easy on high, turned all the way up. No need for the lid. Now, we're gonna make a salsa for this Wahoo. I've got some lemon and lime juice here. More garlic paste. I'm going to put the exact measurements down below in the description box. We've got some chopped tomato, some cilantro, and a good tropical salsa just wouldn't be there without some red onion. Sorry, my spoon's a little loud. A little salt and pepper, not too much. And then I've got Jalapeno. This is optional, but with all the sweet and all these flavors, this jalapeno just blends in great. 
You can cut it back if you want, but I would encourage you to at least use some jalapeno if you're worried about it being too spicy. Oops. Because it just adds a wonderful flavor and it kind of, uh, you know, counteracts all the pineapple. And that's all there is to it. We'll serve that up after I clean up this mess I've made with that wahoo when it's ready and it won't take long. It's been right at 50, 55 minutes. It could have cooked quicker if we'd have put the lid on it. I don't like to cook with the lid. You can see I've only got one in here. The other one finished up about five minutes ago. You want 145 on this. See, I've got one of them already here. There's our second one. We'll let them rest about 10 minutes and then you know what we're gonna do. Taste test. Wahoo's been sitting here 10 minutes, resting. Look at it, you gotta admit, right? Wahoo comes from the Pacific, we got it up with the pineapple. Look, I get Look. no credit on the salsa recipe. Y'all know Tammy, she came up with that. Let's just have a look at what this fish looks like. Look at that, super white. I hope you can see that. Let's get a little of that salsa. Oh, yeah. All right. If you've never had Wahoo, it's kind of got a texture like tuna, except it is much more mild. Way milder than tuna. You don't like fishy taste? This is the fish for you. Absolutely incredible. Look, look at that. Just, can you see the juiciness in that? Juicy on the top. Look at that. And that's why you want to have a sauce or something. This is one of those fishes, if you cook, no seasoning, no salsa, you're going to think it's bland. You put a little marinade in it like we did, a little salsa, it's incredible. Thanks so much for watching.